Hello friends, welcome back to another tutorial. This is tutorial number two and uh, I have a question for you. Do you know why did not the spider go to the school? Well, because he learned everything on the web. <laughs> Today we are going to talk about how you can use Python and the Selenium automation tool to extract data from a table. For this tutorial, I have chosen this table over here. One requirement is that you have to have installed the Selenium web driver in order to follow this tutorial. If you have done it already, then please open up the editor of your choice. I'm using the Visual Studio Code create a Python file called spider and then we have to import the web driver from the selenium package and we're going to do that by saying from selenium import web driver next up we have to import the class called by from selenium dot web driver import by next up we have to import a class called options now let us define the driver We're going to paste in the default options. After that, we have to create a method. I am going to call mine main. And at the bottom of the script, write the if statement. If name equal to main call main good now we have to instruct the browser to open the specific URL first go to your browser copy the link of the page we would like to scrape head over to your IDE and type driver get paste the link and with that we have instructed the browser to go and fetch this URL. Now next up we have to create a reference to the table body. Open up inspection tools, locate the table body, right click on it, go and copy and copy XPath. We're going to call this variable tbody and we're going to say driver, we're going to find that element by xpath and paste the string. We also have to create a empty array which will later on store the data that we scraped. So we're going to make a variable. I'm going to call it data and it's going to be an empty array. Now, if we look at the T body, we can see that it has a lot of table rows. What we want to do is to loop through each of these table rows one by one and extract the data from it. So first we have to create a for loop in Python and we're going to do that by saying for and I'm going to name this variable tr very convenient for tr in tbody find elements by x path and then we're looking for all the elements that are t 
R or table rows. Now that we are inside of each of these table rows at a time, we can see that each one of them has three data cells which hold a link. So we are interested to loop through each of these data cells and get the text of the links. So for that, we have to define a variable. We're going to call it row. And row is going to be an array that will hold all this text of the links. So inside here, we have to create another for loop. And we're going to do it by saying item dot text for item in tr find elements by xpath and then we're looking for the data cells. We also now have to append this information to our data array by saying data dot append row. Now we can also print the results, save the file and open up your terminal and execute the script. As you can see, we have successfully extracted the data from this table. We made it. Congratulations. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe to my channel to see more tutorials on this topic.